Hello, welcome back. Steve's Retirement Corner. Expenses in retirement. This was going to be a double video about how I thought about expenses and debt last year versus when I was getting ready to, when I was planning to retire versus this year now that I've been retired for a few months. But it's going to be so long, I split it up and do expenses today and my thoughts on debt Monday. <laughs> That's retiree brain slowing down. <laughs> but uh be honest with you, my my ideas and thoughts on retirement ain't changed hardly at all as far as uh my expenses go. Last year I said uh, well I always say it, you know. Having no debt and low expenses in retirement is a huge deal. It makes up for a lot of mistakes and problems. Gives you a lot of room for error if you got both of those. It just does. And this is where I looked at it last year. You know, if you can get a handle on your expenses and your debt and keep them under control, it's a big help all your life. I mean, it gives you room to save when you're younger. And it gives you room for something that comes up when you um, when you need it in retirement. But in retirement, it's just magnified that much more, I believe. Because uh, as you age, your ability and opportunity to go out there and make an extra buck when you need it is... Uh, gets smaller and smaller less and less you just don't have that opportunity and ability to do it as you age like you did when you were 25 or 40 I don't think so I don't foresee that happening for me I, don't, I just don't see me at 70 being able to go out there get a full time job and work double shifts I mean, hey, I've known people that could do it, but I don't see me being able to do it. Maybe. I don't know. I don't talk much about it because it's nothing that ever comes to my mind. It's not something I've been concerned of. I consider that we're doing pretty good and we've got everything under control. But it's an extremely important part of your retirement. It's important all your life. In retirement, it is huge. <clears throat> You know, and we, uh, you know, I've said this all along, we weren't looking to do nothing but uh, carry our life right on through retirement just like we lived beforehand. And that's one thing this year has proven to me that we're able to do that with no problem, little to no problem. And that's all I was looking for in retirement. I wasn't looking for nothing grand or major. You know, it's a... Uh, You know, you, you tend to um, you tend to look at things according to what you know or how you grow up or what's uh, normal to you. You know what you see all every day. And well, I've said it before. That's the way I designed our retirement, or my retirement, our life in retirement. You know, we're not doing nothing, nothing different. And our lifestyle is uh. A little bit I guess you say low and slow you know it's extremely boring <laughs> it's ordinary it's nothing far out and fantastic but we enjoy it you know I mean it doesn't cost us a lot to live day to day you know I mean take you a couple of weekend trips a year you know two three days here and there and where we live at is so close to everything we were within the day's drive nine hours I believe it is to Daytona that's driving time so you had a couple hours in 12 hours say you know but I mean even if even if we stop and spend the night halfway you know it's the same for Niagara Falls we can get there in eight or nine hours you know? so I mean the places we go Charleston or uh, Myrtle Beach Savannah or something like that I mean you're talking five, six hour drive. We can be home in a couple of days. 
you know, get down there and spend a couple of hours, a couple of days and come on back to the house. You know, I mean, it doesn't cost hardly anything to buy a couple of packs of fish hooks and sinkers, you know. So, I mean, we got fortunate. We had a low-cost lifestyle that we we enjoyed. It was out of need at the time because I was only one working outside the house. So we got used to it. The baby knows how to stretch a dollar dot, let me tell you. <laughs> she knows her job better than I know mine. But, uh, and expenses are so, so fickle depending on where you live at, what part of your state you live in, what part of the country you live in. I mean, that's, you know, your hobbies and stuff, what you enjoy, it, I don't know, it just, they can be such a big change in them, depending on your surroundings and stuff, they just are, and honestly, that's the way I thought before I left, all that, you know, I, I knew we didn't live grand, we were comfortable and happy with how much we spent. And it's under control. And that's just what I wanted to carry on. So, I don't know. Listen, y'all, and uh, enjoy your weekend. Enjoy it the best you can. When you get a couple of days off, Doc, you need to enjoy it. Yeah, they don't, they, they few and far between when you're working. When you're retired, sometimes it's still few and far between. <laughs> but, uh, Y'all take care, and we'll talk to y'all later.